Come on, work. Work. God damn it. now thing is this Why is it down hmm damn it a second Fresh it. Connect all the channels. Get. All right. Yeah, we should be fine now. Am I alone? Maybe you are. I'm here though. <laughs> Hi, by the way. Vibe Disney. I just started. So. Uh, I have some technical difficulties, like usual, but hopefully it'll be a bit better now. Mm. Today I'll be drawing a Magista IBC. Hi. Or Magista. Hi, how are you doing? Today I'll be doing... <laughs> Great. I'll be drawing a dog. Painting a dog. Most likely. And also, I finally... Hi from friends. Hey. I'm from Czech Republic, that's not that far away. Hi, how are you doing there? And... Yeah. I've created a Discord for our channel. The link is in the description of the stream on YouTube. Hi from Armenia. Ooh. Hi. Uh, and yeah, the Discord will be like, mostly for questions and stuff. Like, you know, questions and answers, Q&A kind of stuff or discussion about art, discussion about Krita and stuff like that or if you have any problems with Krita and you know, all, all that stuff. There will be and also about updates on channel like when the video is coming up, when I'm streaming and stuff like that so you don't miss it. Maria or Faye, I'm from Italy. Hi Maria. Hi LPS Venus from Wales. It's quite a lot of people actually today. When I like, I just started. <laughs> That's weird. <laughs> Usually people game a little bit later, but it's fine. Actually, it's more than fine. Yeah. You know. Okay. What I'm gonna do? The first thing I'm gonna do today is to redo this quick sketch I did, so it's like a little bit better, a little bit more defined, and I can work with it. And I also need a different color. That's what I'm talking about. Hi. Is it your dog? No, 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 no. This is for a friend. Actually. My dog is smaller. <laughs> My dog is smaller. <laughs> Way smaller. This dog is like huge. I'm still not 100% convinced of all this sketching brush. 
uh, that's like the best I can do right now. So I will probably make him a little bit happier right now. Because... Maybe I'll do a little bit more with the eyes and with the mouth as well. I'll see. Also, I'm really sorry if the stream is gonna like cut, cut out out of nowhere. Because for some reason, my internet is not really <laughs> cooperating <laughs> with me. I need to do a little bit of... Can she rework a few of, the, a few of those like, details? Otherwise it's quite okay, I think. Damn, <laughs> I can't even imagine how he looks. Probably Pitbull, Shida. Ooh. Interesting. I literally can't imagine how he looks. Are you using? I'm not really sure what you mean by that. Can you like rephrase it? Oh, we just got there. Hello, the Emerald Princess. How are you doing today? Yeah, third day we're doing doggy. Really big doggy, actually. I'm doing one thing and I kind of forgot I'm trying to teach myself again how to use my hand to draw, like arm to draw, not my wrist. Because I was kind of sloppy and in the last few months I was a little bit not drawing at all. I didn't really drawing at all and I forgot a lot of stuff actually. How to draw the way that my Arm is not hurting. Top. Oh, graphic tablet. Okay, yeah, I'm using Wacom Intuos Pro M. It's like the it's the 2015 ish model. It's like the first Pro version of Intuos that came out. You know, it was the, the one after Intuos 5. Like this Intuos is like before Intuos was Intuos. Now Intuos is bamboo. <laughs> and if you want like Intuos, you have to go to the Intuos Pro. Uh, where are we? Uh, he's big, quite intimidating, uh, intimidating, but he is a big teddy bear at heart. Yeah, yeah, those are usually not like that. Will the video be on the channel later? Yes, it will be, hopefully. It depends. Uh, okay, if there will be like way too many, uh, disconnects from my side, you know, like there will be like 
cuts out in the stream. I have to download it first and like glue it together and then re-upload it on YouTube. So that's like, that's either, either video will be up, like either stream will be up tomorrow morning, probably, or maybe to today after the stream, I don't know. Or uh, like in the next week, probably. Mm. I have a bad dog, his name is Boss. <laughs> nice. This dog is called Daryl. Uh, I need to scan the drawing or make it with tablet. With tablet. It's like, yeah, I deleted few layers. I didn't need them. With like construction lines and stuff like that. Because I need it. So it's more cleaner. So I will be printing this later. To have it as clean as possible when it comes to layer management because my paintings usually look really different than this i don't know if you saw my my river painting it's like eh, way too many layers <laughs> uh but since my uh since i'm my sister what my sister and her can try moving in with me me my mom and dad her kids are up. Okay. Drawing the X, so keep that in mind. Or painting the X in general. Just too much, too much hair on them, you know. I don't know why I need this one. But it's probably makes sense, you know. <laughs> Sometimes it will make sense in the end. Pretty sure. You know, those are supposed to be like brownish color. This is like black slash brown. So, yeah, I got a few adjustments. Supposed to be probably black. Just like a part of him. Yeah, that should be about it. I don't really need much. Okay, I will try to do one more layer to kind of fix the eyes. Cheerful. Like 
something like that in the mouth. And the eyes. I'll, I'll figure out something to do with the eyes. Hmm, we'll figure it out. Right now, I'm thinking about doing some kind of background in here, which could be we got, we got blue, could be orange here actually. Yeah. one thing I always like recommend if you're painting don't ever paint on white because it will mess up your colors and the contrast most likely and saturation as well contrast and saturation will probably mess up for you because white is kind of way too aggressive colors to work with that's why you shouldn't you should try like just never use it like you can use it in some cases, but try not to. You know, doing some neutral color here. Maybe even. A little bit differently, but this one, this one also sucks. Uh, maybe. Nope. And big no. Oh, I know which one actually. Uh, sources. Looks like it. The rest was smooth. Or was it this one? Oh, oh wait, I thought that wasn't this one. Or this one. Eh, maybe actually this one. Well, it doesn't really matter, does it? Oh. I did not. What? Oh, hi, Mark. What? <laughs> Do I have any problems? Sans? Do I have any problems here? Can now actually group those layers together. Uh, do we want to? That's the question. Probably not. That's not what I wanted to do. Oh, you don't get the meme. I understand, bro. Have a nice day. What? Okay. <laughs> Goodbye then. <laughs> I don't need ya. I can be on my own. I only want the group then. Quick group. There we go. And now we have to change this one to be. You know, overlay. Which doesn't really work for multiply. In our case, will be probably better. There we go. I need a color. I'm genius. Again, there's the knife. Again, the understandable. Have a nice day is a meme too. My meme is weak. No, my meme is meme game is on on the like spot. As you know, my memes are a little bit older than yours. My memes are actual memes. You know, yours are just 
some bullshit. Don't worry, I will do some Before we actually start, give me a second. Okay, so don't mind me yet. That will be time to mind me. That's not the color I want it. Damn it. I'm kind of pissed right now. Don't worry, it will work out in the end. Trust me. All of my paintings did so far. <laughs> Usually they do. Okay. I don't crazy. Damn it. This is kind of scary. This is kind of scary. We got it. We'll, we'll figure it out. What is needed. This seems to be needed. So where is... So, where is the mystery lady when you need her? <laughs> she's nowhere to be found. I think she's sick or something. If I remember it. I just muted myself. <laughs> okay, okay, I'm doing it now. I'm just still I'm just not gonna do the fucking hotkey anymore. I'll just delete it. Cause why 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 would I need it, right? Why would I need it? Where are we? Okay, I'll just, just delete it. It won't happen again. I did just did it, okay? I just did it. I just removed the hotkey. For good, it's, it's not gonna be there anymore, okay?
<laughs> looks at the whiteboard sometimes already. No, it happened like two times at top. Where are we? Uh, two times? Smart. No, it happened at least three times. In one stream. Yeah, but not in this one. See? Much more. Me being smart. Discord server for the Discord server is for Q and A's for talking about art, talking about Krita. If you have a problem with Krita, you can solve it there. Uh, I will. I'm planning doing like art critiques on Discord as well, and yeah, about news about the channel and stuff like that. So actually, a lot of things. Or a lot of things. Mostly just used for Mar to be able to talk to his audience, so he very kind with them also stream. Yep. <laughs>
Sorry, I'm not talking. I'm a little bit concentrated right now. <laughs> he looks kind of scary, to be honest, right now. But I'm sure it will be better. Don't worry. We we gonna we gonna get there. Yeah. You know, the place where he's actually not scary anymore. The death stage. It will take a while. I can't wait to get a new PC because the one I have is very useless. <laughs> There's a lot of bugs and problems in it and when I'm using this one, it's on my artwork and I'm just doing this, get to delete it sadly. Yeah, I can feel ya. <laughs> I don't know if you ever seen my old PC. It wasn't even a real PC, it was like a laptop. And it's hooked. Really big. Really hard. Yeah. Where are we? Literally the same thing has been happening to me with my old computer. I literally can back and drive every 10 hours. Yeah. <laughs> that doesn't sound good. <laughs> This might actually be harder than I expected it to be. I don't want to go. Uh, this is hard. Usually, the first few hours of, of drawing is really hard because you gotta you gotta think and not get you know overcome how bad it will look. So it will eventually look good, but uh, the start will. Just be there, you know. Won't be looking good the whole way. Sorry. Looking great so far. I love Crude, I hope. So powerful and ideal for those new digital painting. New to digital painting, yeah. 
It's like, you don't really need to renew through digital painting. But yeah, it's, it's really good. For any use, pretty much. And it doesn't really look as great yet. It will, I promise, but not right now. We'll get there. Yeah. For sure we'll get there. Something more dark. I'll do something with it. Hi, Wolf Films. Hi, Wolf Films. By the way, hi, Robin, as well. Uh, I think it was blocking support at least one time, so it's fast. Wait, you. What? Why would you go to Wacom support? <laughs> I don't know, I never had these problems usually. Like, usually I don't really have to go to support page for anything. Like, not just Wacom, nothing. I'm like, really lucky guy when it comes to how my product usually works. You know? It's usually working really good, really well, for a very long time. this anymore we need to get something better something stronger something not like this not like this not like this okay. this one maybe
Damn. Where are we? Uh, <laughs> I joined this. I joined the Discord, by the way. You can check who joined. Wolfie! Hi, Wolfie! <laughs> <laughs> Today is a good day for me because I finally get Wi-Fi at work because when I was watching the river painting it was kind of blurry because of how poorly my Wi-Fi was. Ooh. Sorry. <laughs> oh, we get a babushka tea. Hello there. <laughs> got a few guys here. No. Yeah, we'll be posting like stuff there and if you need something, you can go there. Like some help with some program or something like that. Oh, that's what I want. And I will be like... That will be the way how to communicate with me faster. And better. You know what I mean? Faster, stronger. Okay, he looks kind of different than I would like him to look. <laughs> I will be better. Pretty sure. Just fine. Just gotta figure out a few things. Trying to figure out how to make it all work somehow. <laughs> Don't mind me. All right. Where are we? Second one should be like higher. Go over here somewhere. Should be smaller. Yeah. Also, I made like few uh, voice channels there for you as well. One one of them is called Stream. So if you want to chat with each other, if anyone's into that, it's possible as well. Yeah. <laughs> Send. Does someone don't know any good enemies? Having trouble finding some. Uh, uh, my anime game lately is quite weak. Because I haven't really watched anything. <laughs> In the last half a year or something.
Well, there was one about something with Camneri. I totally forgot how it's called. But it's kind of similar to. It's kind of brutal. That's pretty good. It's about like ghouls or something. Oh, it's okay. I will find it. Just give me one more second. There we go. Yeah, it's called Cabinary of the Iron Fortress. It's about trains and shit. <laughs> this is the English name of it. You should find it by that. And it's pretty good. If you're into that, I don't know. Maybe you are. <laughs> Maybe you're not. Who knows? Yeah, it's similar. To, like, it's not Attack on Titan, but yeah, it's similar. At some points, it's like cooler, kind of. Attack on Titan is good and all, but it seems to be kind of overrated these days. And I think this one is like fresher a little bit instead of Titans on Crazy Demons. Yeah, pretty much. And there are trains. I like trains. <laughs> This painting starts to be really hard, to be honest. I don't expect it to be as hard. To do. Especially when normally I'm pretty good. I'm not good in, with animals in general, but like painting them, otherwise. Dogs loves me. Love me usually. Oh, Afro Samurai, really good one. Yeah, Afro Samurai is good. What I also like, it's kind of specific, so I don't know if you will like it. Afro Samurai is really good. Yeah, like the art style of Afro Samurai, one of the best I've ever seen. I have to say, this is like. Best fucking art style ever in anime. Never seen anything similar to that. Like at that level, let's say this way. Never seen anything at that level.
Ooh. Hmm, I can spam the chat with animate daddles, but I'll try not to. Okay. <laughs> Finish the saga with Tani and the Evil. I enjoy quite enjoyed it. I recommend it. Okay. Somehow. Looks kind of better. Yeah, where are we? Uh, from Saga, I I started a while back, though never finished in war. In about war and ten years, generally I would blow on hair or something like that. Oh, we're setting, huh? World War One. I'm gonna get a snake. That's really good idea actually <laughs> I'm thinking about getting something myself I'll probably get a coffee when we're talking about it I wanted to get coffee a while ago so I will get a coffee now I can check who else is here we are Still two only, that's good. But no, it's Babushka cast. <laughs> I'm in credit right now as well, that's great. Well, so, give me like, thinking three minutes, I'll make myself a coffee. And... Yeah, uh, I'll be right back. Watch my dog in the meantime and listen to the music and it's amazing because it's free <laughs> okay be right back uh oh maybe you know what I, will do. I will write a big b r b with explanation board point symbol thing <laughs> whatever all right be right back uh, shit, I smashed my hat, man.
Here we go. I'm actually back now. Hey, a game I recommend is Hollow Knight. Worth every penny, 100%. Well, we are not talking about games. We are talking about anime. I'm gonna die again, see the chat. How am I supposed to know when I just get back? Well... I love the Halloween style of Soul Eater. <laughs> oh. Back, Emerald Princess. Welcome back. If that was that you are back. Because I'm not sure if that was it. It's like really, really fast sketch of the duck because I'm just realizing that I'm not able, like 100% not able to finish it today. But doesn't mean we can't finish it at all. It will be finished, I'm pretty sure. Just need a little bit. I'll probably finish it in my spare time. I gotta finish it in my spare time, which is like the deadline essentially. After a weekend. So Yeah. I will be working on it probably tomorrow. A lot. Yeah. Also I've just reached fifty followers on Twitch. It's amazing. Now I just need to pump up my average viewers numbers and I can get the the thingy so I can get like subscribers and shit. It's good. Okay, we gotta do the other side as well. So with that Question about Kira. Can you make symbols in Kira for animations? If you can, could you show me? Or tell me how? What do you mean symbols? Oh, you mean like in symbols in the meaning of symbols in Adobe Flash, right? Those kind of symbols? Uh, and if that's your question, no, you can't. You gotta, you gotta, uh, like, realize something, okay? Krita is not an animation software. Krita is a software for, you know, painters, like digital painting. A little bit of photo editing. The animation is like, they're still working on it. There might be something like that in the future. I'm not, like, saying that it won't be. But right now, the animation is just, like, for really starters, 
like literally frame by frame animation. You can't. I don't think tweening is even a thing yet. I think there is some, but not really. There are some like features. Mm, I think opacity. You can tween opacity between like, between frames, so at least something, right? But there is like not really a big thing about it yet. And everything right now works on layers, so uh, you would have to split them into layers. Then they could somehow work like symbols in the flesh. But the tweening is like not really supported yet. Yet, like to the highest extent that you can actually use all the, you know, all the moving tools, all those shrinking, whatever, rotating and stuff like that tools. You can't really use them right now, on, like in tweens. But this will be in the future, but I'm not sure about the symbols. So you still have to like use like let's say that you want like multiple symbols, right? So you can look in Krita the workaround would be probably to make multiple layers. Because then you can approach them as a symbols. Not in the like the highest like not fully symbols, you know, because there's like a lot of things that you can do with symbols. And you can do with layers, right? But yeah, about that. It's like, yeah, yeah. Korea is like really in baby steps, you know. It's not fully fledged yet. Where are we? So probably better to just to use like open tunes or macromedia flash for animation. Well macromedia is Macromedia is not really existing anymore, does it? Was Macromedia like their Macromedia like thing Adobe bought Macromedia, didn't it? Or am I crazy? Maybe I'm thinking Yeah, it, it did. Macromedia was Photoshop, right? Wasn't it? Back then. And Flash, of course, and stuff like that. Yeah, you, like... It depends, like, what kind of animation you wanna do, right? If you wanna do, like, drawing animation... Like, frame by frame, yeah, I would use Krita. All the way. If you're gonna do something with tweening, uh, I would probably use some... Yeah, how you said. Yeah, the old version, I thought so. Mm, I think you can get the CS2 version for free. Actually, Adobe is doing that, that you can actually get like CS2 version of a Flash, like of all their products, I think, for free. But don't quote me on that. I think it was possible at one point. I'm not sure if you can still do it. But yeah, I would definitely check that out. Because the CS2 is actually pretty good. Yeah, of course you will be missing some features, but not that many.
Justin Coombs. I hope I, pro I pronounced your name right. Nice job. Did you do the line art from the photos first? From the photo first, then paint. Kind of look like it. Uh, yes, I did the li line art from the photo, but like from the photo I had on my phone. So yeah, I had a reference for that. Initial line arts, I'm doing them. If it's not like original work, if it's like from reference, I'm doing the line arts in advance because it's boring for people to watch. And also, I'm kind of not confident. <laughs> Be prepared for stuff like that. All right, we get him. Am I doing it right? No, I'm not doing it right. I'm an idiot. Here, I am a bloody idiot. What's your equipment you use? What do you mean? Like my tablet and stuff? Or like my whole PC? If you want to know my PC, you can go on Twitch. It's like the whole specs are there. Except, yeah, I have like two monitors. I think I only showed one. And there's everything. Yeah, uh, if you want to know my PC, it's like in the description of the stream here. I'll send it to you. It's in here. And my tablet, I think it even tablet is there. You can check it all. If I'm not mistaken. Give me a second. I'll just check. Yep, it's there. Everything's there, actually. A few months ago, I bought you Cinti 32 HD. Uh, are you sure it's 32? Cause I don't recall them making 32 version. Wasn't it 22? I think 22 was. I'm not sure if Cinti 32 was a thing. Was there a thing? It's possible. I'm like, you know. Hmm. Check the Cintiq Pro. Oh, it's actually a 32 version already. That's cool. Oh, 13. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay, that makes more sense. Oh, they they actually making Wacom Cintiq Pro 32 inch now. It's amazing. Damn. Uh, sorry, I missed that. Who was that? I'll check it. Uh, a second. 
Wolf Howls. Thanks for the follow, by the way. This is a small guy. Yeah, the 13 inch is okay, for starters. I would personally like to have a bigger one. At least like the 22 inch model. But only because it's like a display tablet, you know? Otherwise, if you have like normal tablet, it doesn't really... The size is like... The M size of the Intuos is like... Option, like... That's perfect. But if I would have like a monitor, like, you know, display tablet, I would probably want the same size as my monitor, which is like 27 inch, but those are expensive as fuck. So, yeah. But yeah, the 13 inch, I was using it, it was quite fun. I enjoyed it. But yeah, when I'm gonna buy some, I'll probably buy the bigger one. Just because, you know. <laughs> Thank you for the follow, by the way. When you did not add the furs and stuff, it kind of looked like a demon dog. Well, but it looks really good so far, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it did look like a demon dog. That's why I was telling you that, yeah, it, it sucks now, but it will get better, trust me. <laughs> Just gotta trust me, you know? Add a little bit more detail over there. I got a cheap ass tablet, Why model H420. I heard about those. They actually, like, for price, they are really good. Like, there is. It's nice that there is finally a, like, alternative to Wacom. Because if there wasn't. I can guarantee you that the prices of Wacom would go still up. And up. And up. There will be no stopping. Right? Now it's kind of re regulated because, like, even. Because before there wasn't really a choice, right? You either got Wacom or nothing. Now you got a choice. It's good. Hey, I didn't know you could draw in realis realistic style. <laughs> well, I am Goody Gasket. Well, I can. I'm not doing it so that often, but I can. It's just, you know, it's not, it's not really enjoyable for me. I enjoy more like. This is like a little semi realistic, weird kind of style of drawing. More than this. Just more fun for me. You gotta, like, understand one thing, okay? I'm probably... Sh I'm pretty sure I'm 
not the first guy who told you that. But if you want, like, pretty much how how drawing goes, right? If you want to be like really good, you know, be like good, good. Usually, you should first lear learn realism. That's the easy part, because it's literally just copying from the real world. And then go to like original characters, right? It depends. It's yeah. Don't take me like too seriously. It just it depends. There's like a lot of things, right? If you're just doing cartoons, it doesn't really matter that much, you know. But if you're like doing, for example, what I'm doing, right? I'm doing something that is not realism, but it's kind of. You need to know anatomy and stuff like that. You know, it's kind of semi-realism-ish. It's still stylized, but it's like, you know, different. Then I would definitely not go for that right away. I would definitely just learn the realism first. Learn all the anatomy, learn everything around that. And then start doing what I'm doing. Because... Otherwise, you will have like nothing to build on. And even like, yeah. Because if you are like doing real, something really stylish, you can still say, yeah, it's a part of my style. But usually those are just like, how do I say? If I find something that's like not working, Okay, where am I going with this one? Uh, okay, let's say that would have a friend, right? Who would say that? Yeah, I'm doing like comic. I'm a comic artist, right? I'm doing just like really stylized, comic y style thingy, right? And he shows me like pictures, right? And I am saying, like, yeah, but this is not really working, right? There's no consistency. He would say, no, this is just my style. Well, style can be a style. If there's some solid foundation for it, like it works in every possible way, like in every possible, you know, for example, if you make a character and you can like literally look at the character from every possible side and you know how to draw the character from every possible side on view, then you can call it a style. But if literally uh, you can draw it from one view and if you do another view, your style breaks and there's nothing there and you don't know what to do with it then that's not your style that's you know you still have to learn something you just you have to learn about like i don't something you know about 3d space you know how to rotate something how to look at the things from different angle how your style works when you like rotate your figure around like some pivot you know and you look at it from each side if you don't know how to do that, you can't really call it your style every time when someone says that, yeah, this is not working. I totally forgot what I was, what was my point in the beginning, but yeah, I'm here. But yeah, I had a friend like that and he was like, always, yeah, but that's my style. And I was like, no, you can't call it the style because you're lost. I don't have a style because I still I'm struggling like hell with the stuff I'm doing that's why I called my channel struggle with drawing because even if, if it might seem that I can do something most of the time I have no idea what I'm doing I just don't and if you see like a video when I'm doing something and it's cool, you didn't see like those, I don't know, 50 hours before that when I was trying to produce something. <laughs> it works. You know? Mart, you cool. Arifreya. Thank you, Arifreya. Or Arifreya, I'm not sure how to pronounce it. Thank you. I like it, looks like. It looks really good to me. Yeah, it's, it's okay. Definitely not my best work. Right, it will be fine at the end. It will be printed on canvas, actually. 
later. On Monday, I have to get. I have to go to the printer shop on Monday. And let it print. So I have three days to finish. Are you on DeviantArt? Yes, I am on DeviantArt. But I'm not really posting anymore. <laughs> I kind of... yeah. I'm lazy, okay. But yeah, you can find me on DeviantArt. I think it's... What is it, actually? Uh, give me a second. Thing it's yeah it's this but yeah I'm not really posting there anymore I can check it
I'm back. What are you all up to? Well, we are drawing, actually. We are trying to be productive, even though you're failing, usually. I had I hate curly hair. It's really hard to draw. Discord. And where would art be posted? Well, uh, huh? Good I Good thing. Uh, okay, I'll, I'll create real quick channel just for art. Um, let's call it art. Show up. No, art. Art. Art, 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 art. Mm. Art tornado. <laughs> okay. You can post it in art tornado. <laughs> it's text channel. Okay, now I'm more motivated to work and stuff I've been working on. <laughs> I can post! <laughs> that was also another another reason why I did the Discord. Because now, when I'm like, you know, on stream and someone wants to post something that is drawing like with me or something, you can post it there and I can see it, you know, immediately. How cool is that?
does perfect even mean? Is there even such a thing? Ooh, ooh. Can we switch up all the rules? And imagine a utopia A darling, I'm just so fed up with these expectations They keep weighing me Hmm. I'm still trying to figure out what could be a good thing to blend. <laughs> that sounds weird. But a good thing to blend for a create a blending tutorial. You know how to blend colors? I have a few ideas. The first one would be most likely orange, like sliced orange. And the second would be sliced <laughs> strawberry. <laughs> And last one, just normal apple, but it sounds kind of boring to me, you know, normal apple thing, you know. That sounds really boring. All right. Also, we can make some, also I'm planning, I was talking about this before, but I'm planning on doing some competitions, challenges, art challenges. I mean, you can call them that, I guess with some prices. So yeah, so I will posting like be posting even some challenges and stuff. Yep, I will do something, and maybe like one of them will be like long term. And it will be with really big prize actually. I still have to like figure out a few things. I don't get too excited but I'll be giving away something for that something 
Uh, something someone will eat. Ah, something cool actually. That would probably cool, very cool. Yeah. Useful for the digital artist. Angela Emens just got on and watched the first part. Then you locked players. Then just locked. It. Then just blocked in. Was thinking you just you just blocked in the colors, but looked like he's. Just still see your line work. For my solid moment, I'm not. So I'm not. So, oh, okay, okay, no, okay. <laughs> Sorry, I got like a little confused from the question. I just watched the first part, then you locked layers. I didn't really lock layers. Okay, my line, line, line work is like grouped in these layers, okay? I can still see them. Kinda. Okay. Okay. Oh, shit. I just worked on the be right back layer, but that's alright. And, like merge them, it doesn't matter. Okay, uh, I can still see my line work, it's still there. I just uh, group them into three layers. I have like three sets of line works under that. Uh, I change the group layer to multiply, so it like if you uh, like zoom really in, so you can see it on your phone as well. Uh, you know, I can still see the lines. They're just like multiplying over my painting. So I can still see them, you know, all of them. Like they're not that visible, but I can still see them. Okay. Yeah, and they'll just win for everyone because you can see a lot of different art, which is great. Yeah, also I'm thinking about, you know, some ideas for challenges like what it's supposed to actually be which people draw because it will be definitely drawing it can be like digital or traditional it doesn't really matter it's not really the thing it will be sadly everyone together it will be like no i remember that just i had like this uh oh yeah just I had like this beginners category. I will probably not do it. I will see. I don't know. Yeah. But I, like, I don't want to like disqualify beginners, but also like I know that. Everyone's not the same beginner, if it makes sense. And also everyone's not the same not beginner, so I don't know where to like draw the line. So I would like I don't know. <laughs> Be right back. Alright. Kevin Brown. Cool. Thank you, Kevin. Hmm. I don't know if you know what I mean. Wolf. Or wall films? Uh, wolf films? Are you wolf imps or wolf wall imps? Wolf films? Or wolf imps? <laughs> I'm not sure. <laughs> That's alright. Make groups, beginners, intermediate, and discord. An expert. Like, who is expert by your means? Because, like...
that's the thing like how do you how do you like differentiate between intermediate and expert like you can't really do that and like for someone who is like really good but he's not really believing in himself or he knows that he can like be better and he thinks yeah I'm intermediate but he's like for you for example expert like I don't want to disqualify him for that <laughs> yeah yeah I was tripping a lot <laughs> Well, I I will figure it out. Like the Discord is still like work in progress right now. I'm trying to figure it out. I have some help from Sans, and I will probably like put some more people there. It'll be like be something like what would I call it? Mm, moderators of the Discord because I won't be there like 24/7, you know not be able to answer all your questions but yeah we judge and we send art in and put us and I put us into group you think we should be oh that's actually a good good idea yeah I will probably do that like that wait I just came back my name was mentioned <laughs> yeah <laughs> we were talking about the discord And Wolf actually had a pretty good idea. About prices for challenges. That I will be like deciding who's who. Who's like intermediate, who's like expert, who's like whatever. It's actually a really good idea. Really good. I'm. Uh. Is learning how to sort my layers. Oh, uh, probably I'm. I'm learning how to sort my layers into sections. Yeah, you can do that. Like with group layers, you can do pretty much whatever you want. You can like group groups and you know go like that and that. And yeah. Like. Usually what I'm doing is I'm not even grouping them, I just group them because normally I would just like, you know, merge them together. I don't really care. But yeah, uh, grouping layers can help you, especially if you're doing like graphic design or like multiple, multiple versions of something. It's really good to have layers and also name them because I'm stupid and I'm not doing that. I usually just layer number 3824 or something like that. Marking the actual layer so don't paint on the wrong layer. Yeah, exactly. I was I was just talking about that. Yeah, you should rename your layers, but uh, I think more more you paint more like more more you paint than you get like more lazy, more you paint, you get more laser, lazy. Like yeah. I'm not even thinking about like anything like that. I'm not thinking about yeah, this layer has to be there or I have to use this this brush. I just like yeah. This brush looks cool, let's just use it. <laughs> or I don't know. Do I need layer for that? Maybe. I just merged them. Did I did I need it to like them later? Oh, that's a shame. Well, let's just fix it. I mean, I'm marked 
best friend so I know everything of where. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> hey, I'm on Discord all the time, so people on, on the server feel free to ask or tell anything, basically. I'm the accountant? Okay. Well, with the best friend, I would, like, yeah. Whatever, man. <laughs> Whatever keeps you going. <laughs> sure you are. <laughs> oh. Sorry about that. I don't like this part anymore. Not have a good graphics program, graphic program, or drawing tablet. You don't have one, or do you have it now? If you have it now, it's okay. Like a good program is Krita, it's for free. You can get it like right away. Graphic tablet, you don't really need anything special. Like literally the bamboo, like uh, Wacom bamboo, is good enough. For anything you want to do. Also the... Uh, I don't know what's the alternative in... Wine? Or... Win? I, I, I don't know how to pronounce that shit. Still minds of one, one layer painting. Well, I'm pretty much one layer painting. Like, I, I'm making like, sketch. Because that's the biggest advantage of flares, that you can actually put the sketch above your painting and paint under it. Which in traditional painting is not possible. It is possible. Uh, it's not really possible. Like, it is possible. Like, if you have, like, projector or something, I don't know. <laughs> uh, but, you know. Yeah, but that's, like, the biggest advantage. But that's like all you need to know. Usually my whole painting is on one layer anyways. Sometimes I'm not even putting that up. up so many paintings at first <laughs> yeah that happens like my paintings were pretty bad they're all they're kind of still are but I don't know how to fake it you know, how to cheat you know it's actually funny because my background is in computer graphics and at the first lecture we had my professor told us that in computer graphics you have to cheat all the time but we are a bunch of ju just bunch of cheaters we are trying to cheat the eye so it doesn't have to be perfect it has to be you know if it can like trick the eye that it looks that it's looking good, then it's good enough. <laughs> That's pretty much it. Pretty paint. 
Well, at first, no. I do know sketchbook. There's like sketchbook that's the Adobe thing, right? No, Autodesk thing. Actually, Autodesk sketchbook. That's it, right? That's the thing. Thing it is. Wine. Okay. I was using ten year old one. Well wine? That's not that old company thing. You paint really good, thank you. <laughs> it's not it's not it yet. And it won't be it for quite some time. Uh we are slowly getting there. We're slowly getting there. So this is wrong. It shouldn't be like that at all. It should be slightly different. A little bit more darker. Over here. Just like that, then like that. Now we take this. Where are we? I uh, why am I practice with regular pictures at first when you get new programs? Screen then paint and back the picture. Okay. Why isn't more people joining Discord server? Get move on, people! No headset mic. I like no cleanup. You don't need like headset to join the Discord server. It's like text groups there as well. It's not about talking there. It's like more about sharing your art and talking with like texting with other people. You can talk as well, but there's like a lot of texting, like the text rooms or I don't want to kill channels. I like no cleanup. Well, <laughs> just tell what if people cheat about the contest thing. He was talking about yeah there I will have some rules about that you like you have to post even like some progress pictures stuff like that uh, about that I'm pretty good at like <laughs> I'm not I'm not it's actually really easy to check if the picture is posted somewhere and just like go to Google and search the picture by you know such put the picture in the I don't know how it's called like image search or something and it will show up if it's posted somewhere so I wouldn't be scared of that um, the, the other thing would be more like that it's actually not theirs that they stole it from somewhere else and in that case, I, I will just want progress pictures. It's easy as that. Just want to see some progress, at least like one or two progress pictures. Our program auto, yeah, free. Okay, it is so as, as big as my panel. <laughs> Okay, I mean, there's going to be contests. We need at least 30 people. 
or I mean, then if we start small. <laughs> yeah, yeah, the contest will be later. Definitely, like I'm not. I need, you know, some people there first, and also I need to figure out a lot of things about the contest because I'm will be sending actual prices, you know, like like you can put hand on them, like physical price. So I need to figure out the shipping, cost of the shipping, and figure out if it's like possible to ship overseas or something. You know? Since I don't have any sponsors, I will have to do it myself. Which is kind, of, you know, kind of problematic sometimes. Especially when you're an artist like me. I practiced with grayscale pictures, then painted it over. So looks the same. Oh, I can help with the rules, I'm good with that. <laughs> I mean, Mar, the price can be just a gift card at first. Yeah, but I want to make like a long term, like. There will be like small challenges like that, right? Like maybe just gift card or I don't know, just drawing from me or something like that. But, or just, you know, we can do like a really small one. Just like, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know right now, okay? But I want to make like one long term for like a half a year or something. So you will have like six months to enter or to work or some on something and the winning prize will be graphic tablet for that that's why I have to figure out the shipping because the thing is kind of big you know I would record what I was working on. <laughs> yeah, you can record. Do you want to join my not free <laughs> gift card giveaway? <laughs> ah, okay. It won't be free. And also, the stream will probably end in like 10 minutes. So, don't forget to join our Discord server. I will post the link in the chat so you can join it and be happy. Or just, I don't know. <laughs> Where is it? Here we go. Bangers. can join the Discord server, it's really cool. <laughs> and you, and you will love it, trust me. <laughs> yeah, I can, I'm just, I'm bad at selling out.
really cool Discord server here. <laughs> what size scans do you work on? Um, I think this one is 6,000 times 6,000 pixels. Which, it has 300 DPI, you know, for printing. So, I don't know how big it is in, like, centimeters or inches. I'm thinking, like, 20-something inches. Uh, I'm stupid and I can't find it. There we go. Okay, so it's... Uh, Okay, the print size is 50, 50 centimeters times 50 centimeters. And it's 6,000 times 6,000. In inches, it will be 20, how is that? It's fun to work your progress. It's a long time. Well, it's fun to watch your progress. Thank you. I'm really glad I found this channel. <laughs> uh, thanks, I guess. <laughs> I'm glad it, you found it as well. I get just deja vu, like really big. One, right now. your next stream well let me think tomorrow no because tomorrow I want to do something else I'll be streaming but on Twitch games uh, Sunday it I will not be streaming on Sunday so probably Monday yeah Monday most likely Monday PC now. <laughs> That's great. At least you can see it now. Cartoon Daniel Levy. I can send you the link. If you give me a second. There we go. This one. My PC would scream at me. Only 8 gig of RAM. That's enough. I was using 8 gig for a very long time for painting. That's enough. Probably six, probably wouldn't handle this big canvas. So yeah, it will probably scream at you. But like, I think I was using like 4,500 times 4,500. It was okay-ish. I'm trying to work, you know, as, as big canvas as I can. 
on most of my painting because I never know if I actually want to print it. And it's good to have, you know, higher resolution and it, like, usually get the highest resolution you can. Every time. So... Uh, I got 3k, 3k, and 100. Painting is looking really good, thank you. Um, 3k, 3k, yeah. By the way, the 100, oh, the 100 DPI, PPI, it doesn't really matter what you put there. Pixels are pixels. That's just the, the DPI is only for printing. That's information for printing, for the printer. How, like, how to, like, convert your picture into real real life dimensions or like you know for example you're just telling you know by the hundred you're telling that 100 pixels will be in a square inch so it doesn't really matter what you yeah it doesn't really matter what you put uh in there like what number but if you want to print it i i suggest to use 300 because it will look better crispier But then, of, of course, it depends. So, you know, you can put whatever number you want there if you like. Gonna print, gonna print, I don't know, hundred times hundred pixels on like one meter square canvas. It will probably look bad, <laughs> anyways. <laughs> but yeah, you should probably like if you want to print something. For example, half times half meter. You need 6,000 pixels times 6,000 pixels to get it like to the highest quality. Not the highest, but the good quality, the printing quality. Oh, ladies, I got a dip now, meeting a friend tomorrow, don't know if you really give a damn, so I need to wake up early. Yeah, I need to wake up early as well. Yes, yeah, we had 12k, well, it doesn't really, usually, like, normal number would be 16. But, okay, good night, Sans. I will probably end in, like, a minute or two, so, yeah, if you have any more questions, Feel free to ask right now. If you still don't are not in our Discord server and you wanna be, join in. The link is in the description. And I'll be ending the stream in like a few minutes. I think it depends on how many yeah, of course it depends on how many layers. Because, like, you have to, like, kind of realize that one layer is those 6,000 times 6,000 pixels. If you put those, if you put another layer, it's now you have, you know, two layers of 6,000 times 6,000 pixels. If you put another layer, now you have, like, three. You know, it's like adding, adding a layer means, like, adding another picture with that size. So, yeah. It's growing with the layers. Of course, I can't have like 100,000 layers there opened. Like, not open, but like visible layers. At the same time, but yeah. It's getting bigger and bigger. Like, for example, right now I'm using about 700 max from my memory. That's alright. I think my highest project was using like 
12 or something. Sure. Okay, I got a question. Okay, come up with it. I do Seth and Tiff. Yeah, uh, Tiff is probably the best idea. It's lossless format. It's like not really format, but yeah, it's, it's lossless container. And it saves the color information as well. So it's good for printing. But sometimes, even JPEG is good enough. You just have to like, you know, not use the JPEG com uh, compression algorithm. Just try to do it like lossless if possible. Or the highest quality JPEG. But JPEG can also hold the color information, which is like more important than some compression. Trust me. There's nothing, no worse feeling than going to the printer shop, letting your picture print it, and the colors are all fucked. It happened to me a lot. So I started using some ICC profiles and stuff. And now it's usually okay. Also, it's really good to do some uh, test prints before you actually do something. Oh, yeah, thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. Well, it's okay ish. Could have been better. I also I wanted to make it like. Kind of messy, not like perfect because the picture will be about thing like this big in real life. Like I have 27 inch monitor, so let's Im imagine that you have 27 inch monitor, or if you have it. So this is about the size it will be, like in the real life type thing. So about like you know, this big, <laughs> I don't know how, how big that is. It's like 40 centimeters maybe? Times 40 centimeters. So I don't actually have to go like into like this kind of detail, not even this kind of detail, not even this kind of detail. I just need to make it look good from this size. I try only use three or four. Well, yeah, it's okay. Like three or four layers are okay. You can still work with that. Hmm, I was drawing pose for this witch, but I couldn't get it right. How can I get it right where it looks more lively with the right pose? Well, I was drawing a pose for this witch. But I couldn't get it. Can you post the picture? I don't know if you post it, but I'll check it. General. If you can, can you post it in the... Like for poses, usually is... The most important thing for poses is a flow. Like... You gotta figure it out something, right? For example, if you want it to be dynamic. You want to have curves. Oh shit. What is it? Uh, am I stupid? Huh? Okay, no, no, I'm talking. Okay, if you want to have a pose that's dynamic, that you want more like life like, you want to have curves, right? For example, I don't know, you have a curve, right? So this is like a shoulder. I don't know, we can go other shoulder, right? Yeah. This and can go like that. I don't know. Oh, this should be shorter. 
fight this for us. Alright, then you go like that, then you have... Like, yeah, you can go like a dynamic pose, right? This would be like dynamic pose, somehow. Perfect, but yeah, it's there. But if you wanna like, I don't know how, what's the. I just changed the way. <laughs> oh well, free on PC, and four on external. Yeah. I changed the wish to ghost. Well, so example, I don't know. Let's say that you wanna have a witch on, and also wait. Wait is really important. So you, you can't really do this, right? So like, you know, like this stiff figure, right? You need to make it like weighted a bit. So for example, if she's standing just like that, you can still make it weighted, right? You can still make, let's pick a different color. You can give her some weight, right? You can still do that. I can give her a little bit more weight. By just adding some curves to her. I'm, I'm an idiot. Don't mind me. been a while okay <laughs> so I don't mind me so like the belly button right the most important weight distribution is in the shoulders you can like give her some shoulders right so she's like I don't know how to explain it so she's like not flying so everything has to have some kind of stress on it. My hands are going, you know, like around the body. They're like not just flying like that. Yeah. You know, you want to give her like normal pose, like normal T, like this, not T pose, but like standing pose. Just not making like the hands fly. Make them like go around the body because that's how you would normally stand, right? I don't know, this is not really good. But whatever. Okay, it's gonna be better. So we have like this kind of body. Okay, let's make this even less visible. Oh, this one was good. Okay, you have like head, right? That would be like shovels and arms right so let the arms go around the body that can give it a little bit of life to it I can go like the flags right Just some stress, you know, it's not this line, it's not like straight line, it's a curve. That's the way. Curves give life pictures, let's say this way. <laughs> Jamal, dog, hi, Daniel Montreal. I can do one layer painting. 
Let's just draw the skeleton as guidelines for anatomy and get it into pose you want. Yeah, you can do that or just start drawing normally, but usually like you can get the pose with like just few simple curves. You don't even need to do like this skeleton thing I did. I just want to try it, you know. You just need like pose to be, I don't know. I was usually doing just poses like that, right? Okay, this is a little bit too exaggerated, but now I can do like, like some blobs, right? It's gonna be really weird. Uh, okay. Okay, now he has one leg there, one leg going there. And he's running! Whatever. <laughs> like, yeah, but I would really start with like guidelines, especially if you're doing something like really crazy. But yeah, just put some weight to it, because you have to always imagine that there is some kind of structure under the picture, or there is a skeleton under the face you're drawing. And if this, if like the, if the skull is like, it's impossible to fit skull in the face you're drawing, then that means you probably did something wrong. Look up pose helps a lot. Yeah, or or just go to I don't know, sketch daily. You can, you have like a lot of poses there. Hi, Daniel. Hi, Jemel. Sorry, but I'm about to end the stream right now. <laughs> uh, I've been doing a little bit of overtime anyways. So I draw the skeleton. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Pretty much, yeah. First start and it was running up to two gigs. Yeah. This, we are up to one gig. My defense. Like, I have like over... Six, seven, even twelve, I think. So yeah, that's how we would do it. And the human body tall is like seven heads. Yeah, it depends. It's between six and a half and eight. And also, everyone's not the same. That's just like it's not a rule. It's more of a like help, a little helper if you're like lost. You can go with that and start with that, but then you realize, eh, six and a half works better for me, or seven works better for me, seven and a half works better for me, eight works better for me, even five can work pretty good for you. It doesn't matter, it depends. Like, what you're doing right now, you know? If you're doing, I don't know, some really stylish character, you can, you can make work, you can make character with, like, three heads, right? Like one, two... Three, right? This will be like his his eyes, right? We have good nose, his nose, like his mouth, ears, right? Making like some kind of hair going on. We can make a neck. And small legs. You can work it like that, right? If it's, if it's stylized, it can work. Try a simple pose over pick. Can help just the drawings. Uh, I wouldn't. I wouldn't trace it. I would never suggest tracing. Better just look at the picture, for example, on your phone or open like browser on on the right side of your screen, and on the left side, open your canvas, for example. In Krita, you can just you know hit the top to hide, like hide everything, and you will have only your pen. Don't erase anything and just like make like, I don't know, nine or even more. Like just split up your canvas into few parts and just draw that one pose, for example, 20 times. And that will help you to understand. If you draw it 20 times and then you start kind of understand how it works, 
And if you don't know how it works, just try to make it yourself. You know, try to do the same pose on your own. To kind of understand like what's going on, right? Where the shoulders are. How? What's the line between the shoulders? What's the line between? What, like, what are the angles between your hips and your shoulders? You know, so you can understand it, right? Because normally, like the pose is defined by a few things, right? You can either define by curve, or you can you can define it by this angle. Right? If I would like do this angle, let's say alpha, so I know like this angle between those and those makes this pose. Okay, anyways, except the one supposed to be different from Metal Gear, make everyone with the same height. Oh, that's interesting. Didn't know that. The one supposed to be different. Yeah, that makes sense. To differentiate and to bring some attention. Okay, anyways, whenever I finish, I will go see. Okay. Oh, my pain died. I got to charge. Do you have to charge your pain? That's weird. These pens are never, like, I don't even know if they are, like, I, I don't know how they're doing it. Maybe they're charging through the tablet or something. I don't know. But they are working all the time. I have this tablet for four years now. I think. When is the next stream? Next stream is on Monday. Same time. Probably. Yeah, same time. Maybe hour er earlier. I'm not sure. I will see. Today I, I was like, literally, I was home like, I got home from work like half hour before I started streaming. So, yeah. It was a long day. So anyways, well, this is the end of our stream. We did a little bit of work, not much, but it's okay. I will still have to finish it tomorrow, and I hope you like the stream. Yeah, you too. <laughs> nope, you cannot do 6k. Yes, you can. I am doing 6k. <laughs> <laughs> have a great weekend. Okay, right, thank you. And you too have a great weekend, all of you, and thanks for showing up. Don't forget, like, those who are just joined in, to join our Discord. If you if you want to, will be like some art challenges and also updates about that, and you can talk about art with others. And this is the link. No, that's not the link. Shit, the link is in the description. I'll post it once more. This is just the song I was sending it. Okay, this link. And yeah, I will do like some updates on videos and stuff like that. There. And updates on the channel and when the stream will be and stuff like that. I'll post it there. Like in advance, for, for example, a few, few days in advance before on Twitter. And yeah, that's it for today. Thanks for watching. And I hope you, I hope I'll see you in the next one. Okay, more out. Bye, everyone. <laughs>